we realized that it's possible using light and sound to synchronize the brain. There are things about the brain that we're learning. As a matter of fact, we've been learning them for a hundred years. Early on, we realized that it's possible using light and sound to synchronize the brain, to get the brain to follow a certain beat or rhythm. That was called the frequency following response. Later on, we called it brain entrainment. Well, science keeps on going, and now we realize, although that's true, there's something even more important, and it's called the dynamic frequency response. There was frequency following, now dynamic frequency response. What does that mean? It means more than in training the brain, we can actually engage the brain. This is the core of neuroplastic change in the brain. It's where neuroscience is at, and that's what we have with the neurovisor.